Hello everybody, this is Mr. Huma, and today we are playing some Minecraft, and I've been playing quite a bit, and so I may have finished the Blaze Farms, and I may have also finished a way up and a way down, and I will explain that just here, it just falls down to, to uh, ladders. This is my Blaze Farm area. That's one of them, and they both work together. I can stand one, two, three, four. I think right here. Three, four. Yeah, right here. That's the special block. If I stand right there, then they will both spawn. I mean, I don't know if this only this block. It could be these ones. I don't know, but I know this one is dead center in between both of them. And I have a enchanting station, which does work up to level thirty. I have an anvil. Yeah, so I'm not going to go off explaining how all these, all this works, it just works. Oh, I guess I need this. This one is normal though, right? Yeah. And I have a hopper to a chest. I threw stuff in here from working on those. I threw a hopper in the, to a chest so that the blaze rods will get picked up. I can't reach the ones back there most of the time. So there we go. And yeah, it works really well. I was AFK for about 20 minutes and I hit level 41. 20, 15 minutes probably more like. And I hit level 41. So it's decent rates. And then I have a piston elevator here. me all the way back up and pushes me over. So the piston elevator is not my design. There's no way I could have made something that... Whoa, I almost just walked off. The annoying thing with this is I missed a redstone dust here. Like, I placed redstone dust here. If you don't, then, like, this piston wouldn't push up. And I missed placing one somewhere. And so then I had to figure out... I didn't know that, so I tested it. I went almost all the way up to the top and then fell down and died, so... How many deaths do I have now? Number of deaths, 11. I had one before. So I've died 10 times working on this thing. So, it was a pain, but it's all functioning, working fine now. I'm gonna have stone slabs going down this side, and then I'll turn this whole wall to sandstone. And then down here is a pathway that leads to my portal, and my portal is now... 110 blocks above the nether so I don't have to deal with ghasts because they were a pain to deal with. I didn't have a bow either. I really should have brought a bow, but I didn't have one. And my helmet broke. I didn't really realize it. I realized it was almost destroyed, but I didn't realize it was that destroyed. So, I no longer have a helmet. And it had a protection 4 on it too, like it was a decent helmet. And I'm going, oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to take this and do that so I can get some books. Because I don't have an enchanting station at my home base, so I have to use smite flan, it's useless. So I have to use like this one, or I have one at my cave spider farm, but even that's like a few hundred blocks away from my base so uh yeah so i thought i'd recap just cap you guys on on this i probably should have recorded while i was building some of it it probably would have been the best thing to do but i didn't because i sort of just i can't really record just whenever i want i'm just gonna head on home here i can't record whenever i want i'll leave it because I have my, my new gaming computer, which I haven't done a video on, and I plan on doing a video explaining it sometime. Maybe later today, I'll play Battlefield 3 and explain my computer. But, uh, so my new gaming computer is in the same room as my dad's computer, and he is, and I can only play video games at certain times throughout the day. And so I play pretty much all my video games in the evening, and he gets back from work, and he goes in his computer, and he's on that for pretty much all evening, most most nights. So, 
I have Thursdays because he's busy Thursday night, so I record Thursday. So you guys will usually see a video Friday, maybe Thursday night, but not likely, but probably Friday. You guys will probably see a video almost every week. Um, so I can't record whenever I want. I kind of have to wait until he's a busy, or I have to like ask to be able to record. So I'm hoping to be able to figure out like a schedule. So I like I have I own the the gaming room this night and this night and that kind of thing. But oh yeah, I forgot he was there. And I'm too used to playing Lodo, and I just pressed shift to sprint. And he just despawned? Where did he go through? Did not check. He went through. He went through. Okay. He's just jumping. Yeah. Oh, like, no knockback at all. Well, wow. okay, so I had a baby, oh, I hate the rain, I hate the sound of rain, I had a baby, uh, a baby zombie pigman in my base, and so that's why this guy has been moved, he used to be over there, I moved him because I was trying to get them together, and then I didn't put a helmet on the zombie pigman, so he despawned. Come here. Come here. There we go. So he despawned, so I was kind of bummed by that. And they almost killed me like five times or something. Like, no joke. It was really annoying. I would just not think something through, and then they would escape, and... Yeah. It was really annoying. Because they were in this book back. And I have been working on this a little bit too. Is it nighttime? It's not nighttime, is it? Oh, it is too. It's just really bright out. Hopefully the rain stops. Oh, also my shaders. I should activate those. This is what it looks like when it's raining. It's like foggy like that. Now you can see stuff is more crisp and that kind of thing, but how it's foggy. That's what it's like when it's raining. It's like really cool. Oops. <laughs> Okay, I feel like, oh yeah, my texture pack, I took that off, I don't know if I explained this before, but that's what was making my game crash, how I thought it was the shader, because it was in like a beta 1.7.2, but it was the texture pack, so I just, I have the default texture pack now, and also there's an update for the shaders, and now grass moves, flowers move, and crops also move, trees do don't yet. Yeah, they're not moving yet. But hopefully soon. Yeah, over there you can see that moved a little bit. It's all moving a bit. I don't know if since this is like all covered, I'm gonna guess that stops the amount that it moves. But I don't know. So it's pretty cool. I don't know if these move. Whoa! I guess there is still some bugs. Oh, was it because I was looking at this? That's moving, and then does this move? Maybe that's not what happened. I don't know. This some stuff still glitches out a bit, but it's to be expected, I guess. It is just like a beta 1.7.2. So I'm working on this. I have this, as you know, of changing out my. Oh yeah, whoops, forgot about that. Put that in there. And change out my redstone chest a bit, gonna add a few more things in there eventually. And I've added dirt and grass, two for cobblestone, one for stone and stone brick, and then stairs, planks, uh, sorry, stairs, slabs, planks, raw wood, saplings. That's as far as I got so far. Now I have to go exploring in order to be able to get some of the which way was it like that? I think. The different kinds of wood, like I need jungle wood and spruce wood or pine wood or whatever it's called. So I think today I'm going to go exploring a little bit with. Uh, do I have wool so I can make a spare bed? 
Yes, I do. Oh, I got my book in here as well. Alright, ah, uh, what am I looking for? Wood. I'm looking for wood. I need to go get some. Okay. Oh, and I can throw these in there. Okay. Yeah, gotta go exploring for some of the, those different kinds of woods here. What am I looking for? Man, I keep forgetting stuff. One, two, three. And bring enough for a crafting bench as well. Throw you up there and you. You in there. Rotten flesh. And blaze rods, I'm sort of just throwing in here. There. Okay. That can go. That can go. Well, maybe I'll keep that in case I find something good. Okay. I think I'm ready. Let's get to bed. Okay. Now I'm ready. 16 steak should be enough. Okay, so. Oh, that's him. 13, th I'm gonna write this down here, X, I'll just do 14, and then positive 310, okay. And we will travel this way, and I do believe there is like an ocean that way, so I will find, <sighs> I'll go craft a boat, just, just in case, and even if there isn't an ocean there, I should still craft a boat. Bring enough for two, because you will always crash your boats. It doesn't matter how hard you try not to, you're always going to crash a boat. Alright, let's go. I did not find any. I looked over all over that nether fortress. Did not find a single uh, nether wart. So I have to go exploring for another one of those two. Which really sucks. I was really excited about getting potions. And if I had potions, then I could just uh, get some speed potions going. Don't have any horses yet either. I'm going to make a stable for them eventually. Man, the ocean just looks incredible with this shader, and I can barely see the sand. Like, I can barely see one sand from another sand. I already have sunflowers. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't bring all my gear with me, just so if I want to, I can just kill myself to get back. No, because... Nah, whatever. We'll just go. We'll just travel straight north. Just keep heading north. That's just what we're going to do. Wow, there's a lot of squid. I guess then again, what else is supposed to spawn here? Wow, is this all squid? Okay, so if I ever need squid to spawn, just come to the ocean. And is the ocean bed like... Okay, it is actually quite a ways down. Up, quick, 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 quick. It just looks like it's all just like one texture at one height oh it's just glitching out because you can see he's like glitching out in there okay okay another glitch with the shaders i guess so i'll keep traveling on i was gonna say i'll keep traveling on the ocean and then i'll be back when i find something but i'm back i found something although maybe it's just a small little island I don't need oak or birch. I just need jungle. I also want vines. Looks like another mesa, 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 mesa biome. Yeah, another mesa biome. A really, really flat one. 
almost like an island sort of it looks like and I should probably stick with the mesa biomes so that I can hopefully have a chance better chances of don't crash don't crash don't crash don't crash oh, I can't believe it didn't crash uh, so I have better chances of finding a jungle if I can stay in the heated biomes the hot biomes then I can hopefully find a jungle And looks like we're gonna have to go on foot. All right. Yeah, if I ever need clay for any builds, I haven't really used clay much, so I don't really know what it looks good with. But if I ever use clay, I have tons of it because I have so much mesa biome. Ah. Uh. Hardened clay. Nope, we'll just put you back. Okay, so I'll keep exploring if anything interesting happens or if anything interesting, anything that looks interesting, I will start recording again. This looks pretty cool with the shadows and all that. But yeah, if I find anything interesting or whatever, then I'll, I'll start recording, but... Oh, I sort of want to explore this cave, but I won't. Yeah, so I'll, I'll let you know if anything interesting happens, and if not, then I guess you'll see me back home. But I am going to try not to stop until I find something, so I'll be back in a second, guys. Welcome back. So I came across some land, but I think... Oh, is this actually spruce wood? Oh, it is too. I thought it was just oak wood, but... When I got kind of closer, it looked like spruce wood, and sure enough, it is. So I found spruce wood. So all I need... That's oak, though. Yeah, that's oak. I don't want that. That's disgusting. I just want spruce. Oak wood isn't actually disgusting, but... It's so common. Okay. And... This is oak. So yeah, I traveled 3,300 blocks, almost 3,400 blocks. Yeah, it's going to be a pain to get back. But I did find what I was looking for. So now I need to make... No, because I should have enough, because I'll need 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, I'll have enough right now. I just need to get 9 saplings now. That is all I need. Then I can continue on my way. These trees are really nice to like. They're massive. And the sun looks really cool. There you go. Cleared that tree out. So I guess while I wait, I'll explore this a little bit. Oh, have we hit a snow biome? Oh, no, not necessarily. So, so far I seem to be hitting nothing but duds. Even this doesn't seem like much of a place. Seems like a relatively small island. Oh, maybe it's loading over there. No, that's just an island. So yeah, it doesn't, doesn't seem to be too impressive so far. Hopefully it will surprise me, but I'm doubtful. And I've not encountered any hot biomes for a while, so I'm a ways away from finding anything, any jungles. There we go, nine. I'll get one more for a backup. There we go. Let's start exploring. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot here.
I don't see any hot biomes. I might just start heading back home. I'll see what's on the other side of this mountain, I guess. But I think I'm just gonna travel. I'm gonna try and find a good horse if I can find a plains biome. I'll try and find a good horse, and then I'll just try and start exploring. What is this? Probably just like a normal forest biome. And to give you guys an idea of how long I slept once from when I started, I was traveling for a whole... Don't know if I need these peonies. Nah, whatever. I was traveling for a whole day or whatever. I don't know when I left. Don't know if it was morning or afternoon or what, but I slept once. That's what I'm going to do, just to give you guys a, a timetable. And I'm going to just... There we go. I'm guessing this is just a little island. Oh, I see sand. Probably not a desert, but I have hopes. Nope. Maybe there's something down this way, though. Oh, this is more spruce wood. Oh, this is going to be like a cold biome, then, I think. I think my chances of finding a desert or a hot biome are pretty slim here. I'm going to have to head to bed soon here. Yeah. I'm probably just going to head... Did I just... Oh, I thought I just, like, killed the squid or something. What is this? Oh, is it just water? Okay, yeah. I thought there was, like one big like sandy area or something and I was like what <laughs> big sandy area in the big area like yeah let me sleep it's nighttime so yeah I'm probably just gonna head back I that's pretty random I don't have hopes for this place because it's cold biomes and I want to find hot biomes so yeah I guess I will probably head back because it's not not that doesn't look good for me so yeah well guys I made it back home didn't find anything else on that island there it was kind of derpy for me it was for what i needed it for it was pretty derpy so i just had headed back home headed back home came back home and i will now make what i need to make planks not like stairs slabs yeah okay and i have my saplings So spruce is going here. This is moving up. And then jungle will go there. Jungle will go there. I'm sort of trying to sort this out. Whoops. Whoops. By rarity. So oak is like most common, then birch, then acacia, then so on and so forth. That's what I'm sort of trying to do this as. Okay, there, there. Uh, wait, didn't that go up another one? Yeah, it did here, but I shouldn't. I don't even know how I'm sorting this. Like that, like that, then this. Goes like that. This goes like that. And then our saplings. Okay, there. There we go. All sorted. 
So I'm slowly getting through all these items, sorting everything bit by book, bit by bit. Um, but I think that'll be it for this episode. And my plans for these end chests here, as I'm going to put tools in these ones. So I guess axe, shovel, pickaxe, sword. Axe, shovel, pickaxe, sword. And I don't really want to do one for hose, but I guess I'll do one for hose as well. And then I'll probably do diamond at the end, I don't know. I am doing tools at the end of this though, I know that for sure. And then I'll probably have one for mine carts and boats, since I don't think they can be stacked. They can't be stacked, I'm positive. Maybe with this 1.8 update they'll be able to be stacked, but as of right now they can't, so. Um, yeah. I will start working. I'll start working on my animal farm here. Start trying to figure out some designs and that kind of thing. I won't build it without you guys. I'll try and build the majority of this on camera. But I will plan it off camera. That's my my plan for it so far. And these furnaces are loaded, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna go like right here. And then that will also decide the width the the width of my little courtyard area. We're probably gonna tear down pretty much that whole mountain. And that mountain is actually not that big. That wouldn't take too long. A couple hours. Um, yeah. Because I'm going to put this, both my farms here. And then I'm going to have stuff coming along the side. And it's going to be like a big courtyard area that will travel down that way. And then have stuff along the sides. So, that's my plan with, with this world so far. But I guess we'll see how it turns out. And I found a village. I think I've showed this to you guys. A village down that way. A desert village. I checked it. And I guess because it was dark enough inside the structure. Because I trapped villagers inside the structure. Inside a building. I can't say structure very well. Over and over. Um, inside the building. I trapped them inside the building. And I got close enough, and I guess because it was light out and it was dark enough in the building, zombies spawned, and then they were all zombie villagers. So I am sort of bummed about that. There's one dude left alive, but that he doesn't really do me any, any good. So I'm just gonna breed up my cows, but I don't have to do that. I don't have to do that on camera. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. I guess I'll have to find pigs. And sheep and chickens. Cause I don't really have many, I just have lots of cows. <laughs> and I'm also thinking about doing squids on top of this this barn thing. Zoo, barn, animal zoo thing. I'm thinking of doing kinda of similar to this. We have one level, two level, and then a third level. That's my my thoughts on it at the moment. So at the bottom level we'd have two animals, say pigs and cows and in the second level you'd have sheep and uh, chickens and then the very top level we'd have like an automatic squid farm sort of but I don't know how well that would look or how well that would work but that's what I'm gonna that's my thoughts on it so far if you guys have any ideas please let me know I did make a Google Plus account so I can now comment stuff I can comment on your comments about comments from other comments. Whoa. So that'll be it for this this video. So comment away, ask any questions you want, any ideas, I'm open to suggestions. And I will take it into consideration, and I will likely comment you back. Yeah, because I like to comment on comments about comments. Okay, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.